the Bunjathan, the Noble Five, the Holy Five. In the Holy Quran, chapter 33, verse 33, it says, Allah intends to remove from you impurity of sin. O people of the Prophet's household, and to purify you with extensive thorough purification. So who are the people of the household that the ayah talks about? And who exactly are the people of the household? God himself describes the people of the household in Hadith Al-Qisa. Gabriel the Honest Archangel asked, O oh my Lord, who are those under the cloak? The Almighty and All Majestic Lord answered, they are the household of the prophethood and the core of the message. They are namely Fatima, her father, her husband, and her sons. What does our Holy Prophet, peace be upon him and his family, have to say about the holy household? Once again, let's take a look at Hadith al qisa O Allah, these are the people of my household, Ahlul Bayt. They are my confidants and my supporters. Their flesh is my flesh, and their blood is my blood. Whoever hurts them hurts me too. Whoever displeases them displeased me too. Now we know the five that Lady Fatima salam, her father, her husband, and her two sons are the people of the household. They are known as the Panjatan or Panjatan Epak, the holy household. Again, the Holy Noble Five are Rasulullah, peace be upon him and his family, Imam Ali, alayhi salam, Lady Fatima Zahra, alayhi salam, Imam Hassan, alayhi salam, and Imam Hussein. We have learned that the family of the Holy Prophet, peace be upon him, are holy and purified from all sin. We also learn that they hold a very high status in the eyes of God and in the eyes of of our Holy Prophet, peace be upon him. The Noble Five deserve our utmost love, sincerity, and obedience. We pray to God to honor us 
with the love and obedience of the Holy Five in this world and the hereafter. We hope you enjoyed this video. Please like and subscribe to Quran and Ahlul Bayt Inspiration if you have not already done so. And stay tuned for more inspirational and motivational videos. Stay safe and recite Salawat.